Hi, good day to you. Today, I would like to talk about the three top mistakes in research writing. Let me start with number three, the term random sampling. Many use the term random sampling to mean convenient sampling. I do the study on people around me. But in research writing, in research, random sampling means giving everybody in the group an equal chance to be a participant in the study. You could use a random numbers table or even a toss of coin or every 10th person in that group. But the important thing is it is a systematic process. Number two mistake, introduction. Many new students and researchers to the field write introduction as if it is the general essay introduction, a background of the study. No, in research writing, the introduction is the argument that shows the gap of knowledge for the study. We use the related findings in the field to show that this is what we know about the topic, the current state of knowledge. And what is it we don't know? That is the gap of knowledge. And that's why this study is important. So the introduction is to show the gap of research for a particular study. And the top mistake is discussion. Discussion, many treat it as a free form of talking about the results. That is seriously wrong. A discussion is a comparison of our results with other related results. Are they similar? Are they different? And why are they similar or different? And the purpose of doing the discussion is to understand the phenomenon better. So hopefully after I tell you the three top mistakes in writing research papers, writing thesis, you will be able to get it right. All the best.